My fr my fries! Oh Lord. Clarence! Oh man, we sure got him. Yeah, we did. Now he has to have fun. <laughs> I don't know, Clarence is the mastermind. Where are my fries, Clarence? Why don't you come and get them? <laughs> uh, uh. See, isn't this fun? Uh, pink or blue, pink or blue. Clarence! Hi. You best know your place, little lady. Clarence! Come on, Zap, take it easy. I was just kidding. Come back here, Clarence! with Clarence? Oh, well, I'm not here for the food. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, him and a few buddies are playing right now. Oh, well, maybe Sean could join them. You think him and Clarence would get along? Oh, for sure. All the kids love Clarence. I'm gonna kill you, Clarence! Uh, Jeff, will you just listen? Explain how you ate my fries! I didn't, Jeff. I didn't eat your fries! <laughs> This is what you get, Clarence. This is what happens when you eat another man's fries. Jeff, please. I did it. They're right here. They were here the whole time. Here, take them. Oh, no. Clarence, listen. I... I have my own complex reason for things. Things you can never understand. Reasons for people not to touch my fries. Reasons I never go into fun spaces. Well, how'd you get up here? Oh, yeah. Well, um... <laughs> You're not gonna let me die? If you die, I die too. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are playing too rough. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Hi. You, Melanie? Oh, hi. Yes. Oh, you must be Brenda's friend. Yep, that's me. I call me Larry. So how old are you? Uh, <clears throat> I'm 32. 32. 70. Hey, are you a homeowner? Um, no, I, I rent a condo. Condo. So what do you like to eat here? Oh, I've, I've never ever been here before. 
Well, have you tried the crab legs? No, I've never been here. Oh, I didn't get that. Clarence, how you liking your cinnamon rangers? They're, yeah, they're great. I I gotta go do a, a sing. A sing? Yeah, a poop sing. Clarence, don't say poop at the table. I'm sorry, I mean, uh, excuse me. I mean, may I be excused? <laughs> You got any kids? Uh, no, none yet. <sighs> no kids. <laughs> oh, wait. Uh, Are you sure you don't want anything from the salad bar? I got some great pickles. No, I think I'm good. Uh, don't let me stop you, though. <laughs> I won't. <sighs> Why did I ever trust Brenda? <sighs> What, what are you doing here? I think I'll do the questioning here, Miss Baker. What are you doing here? Shouldn't you be at school? Why would I be at school? Because you're always at school. Is that what you think? That, that I never leave the school? Uh... Okay, everyone, have a great weekend. doesn't make sense. Where do you go then? I go home. What? Home? Where? Look, that's not important. Can we just talk about this Monday in class? But how did you get here? And where are your glasses? And why are you dressed like that? And where is this a parent-teacher conference? No, Clarence, it's not. I'm just... Uh, I'm here with a friend. Who, is that guy? Is he your grandpa? No, he's not. So, hey, it's probably time for you to head back now. But how do you know him, though? He's not in our class. I just do. Now, I really think you should go back to your table now. <coughs> this is your son? Oh, no. He's, he's one of my students. <coughs> student. I'm Miss Baker's friend. I'm Clarence. Clarence? I'm Clarence. <gasps> what? I thought your name was Larry. All right, are we all ready to order? Oh, I'll be back later. Yep. Larry was short for Clarence. That's so cool. I've never met anyone with my name before. We're like twin brothers or something. Mm. No, I don't think so. Uh, excuse me. Uh, I need to use the ladies' room. So I'm just gonna... uh. Does Jeff like me? Uh, it says maybe. Uh, forget about him. He's not that cute anyway. Um, excuse me, lady friends. Are you guys talking about this Jeff? <laughs> yeah, she really likes him. I I do not. I just think he's nice and a little bit cute. Do you know him or something? Yeah, he's my best friend, and we eat lunch every day, and you should call him on the phone. He'd love talking on the phone. I don't know. The origami says he might not like me. Here, I'll do it for you. Five, 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 zero, one, zero, one. No! No, 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 no! Hello? You take it! No, no way, you have, you have to, have to talk. talk. This is like your you car. Have, you gotta do it. Yeah. Let me talk. Good evening. Hello, Jeff. Yes. Hi, this is... What was your name again? Melissa. This is Melissa. I just wanted to say that I think you are a real upstanding gent. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Melissa likes me. But something sounded off. All right, buddy. I just wish Clarence was here to see this. <laughs> How did you do that? That was awesome. Do you girls want to have some real fun? I need to call her back. I have to tell her I love no, her. No, man. It's too soon. Too soon. <laughs> <laughs> always says if you love someone, you call them back immediately. No, that's wrong. You'll freak her out. Well, Clarence says... Clarence isn't here. He's at that stupid slumber party. 
Yeah, it is stupid. I bet he's having so much fun over there. Yeah, baking cookies. And probably knitting or something dumb. Yeah, trying on outfits, doing each other's nails. Talking about their feelings. And having dumb pillow fights. <laughs> I don't think I've had this much fun at a slumber party ever. Me neither. I just wish I talked to Jack when I had the chance. Oh, well. <gasps> no. Not oh well. You still have the chance. Did I say oh well when I dropped my cubby worms in your driveway? No. I said oh yes. And I picked those babies right up and I shared them with you guys. Did Columbus say oh well when he couldn't discover Indiana and he landed his plane in Canada instead? No. He said oh maybe. And he put that flag down and he marched right up to the courthouse and he made that bill a law. Uh, clearance stuff? Oh yes. That's why you ladies can vote to this very day. So let's stop saying our oh wells and start saying our oh let's go to justice already. <laughs> yeah, let's do it! <laughs> It's the new kids to do song. I like your face. I look good next to you. It's not even that bad. Yeah, I'm feeling it. Oh, great. Sumo and Jeff are still having a wild bro party in the dude cave. Throwing down like they always do. You have to put your hands like this. Let's go back to my place and hit each other with sticks. All right, Monster Truck fans, all you out there with VIP passes, line up backstage to meet Ray Backburn. Please don't show him your feet. Oh, I wish we had backstage passes. <laughs> Let's see. General admission. Where are they? Oh, no. I'll be right back. Yeah! Right! <laughs> Did you say something, Chad? Jeff, Sumo, let's see those man traps. Easy. Darling, you look marvelous. <laughs> Glue to man. <laughs> Welcome to the dressing room. <laughs> you better chilly out. <laughs> <laughs> Why nice try? <laughs> Pasta la vista, baby. <sighs> I'd like to see that burger getting here now. I think you mean burglar, though. That's what I said. Burger. Like the hamburger. That guy what steals burgers on TV. Well, it's pronounced burglar. But we probably don't have anything to worry about. Except for that guy! <laughs> We should turn off all the lights. Wait, he probably saw us already. We're so dead! Keep it together. This is our time to shine. False alarm, guys. I think it's just Chad. Hey, guys! Wait a minute. If he comes in here, he's gonna set off all the traps. We're gonna kill Chad! No, 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 you just gotta grab some. Tate's sake. Uh oh, he's trying the back door. Not the poison donuts. <laughs> Come on, guys. No one's in trouble. I just gotta look for something. Okay, we just gotta get him in and out as fast as possible without setting off any traps. You guys getting in trouble in here? <laughs> I'm hip to it. Trouble? Oh, what? Trouble? Nah, not at all. Whoa, you're just kidding there, little man. Uh, where do I leave those passes? Oh, I know. The bathroom. <gasps> the bathroom! <laughs> wow! Uh, uh, no, nothing to see. Wait, no. I left him in the garage. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we're in the bedroom? <laughs> 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 Hello, worm. No. Did I leave him in the kitchen? Or the attic? 
Oh no. Let's see. Uh, dining room. A dining room. A cellar. A study. A billiard room. Here, there. Uh, oh. <laughs> thanks. Here. Wait. No. Stay out of trouble. No. Good job, guys. Nobody died. Hey, almost right, Cody. Oh. Oh. Ah. Hey, it worked. <laughs> you, tell the hospital that we're coming. You, open those ambulance doors. Uh. You're gonna be fine, Chad. Clear! <laughs> Get out of here, kid. Give them all the medicine that you got, right into those legs. Chad, you're gonna be just fine. Just don't fall asleep or you'll die. Follow me! Where are we? You'll find out as soon as you turn that frown upside down. Oh boy, I'm having a wonderful time. Hey, look at that, we're here. Sheep's Bridge? How did you? How? <laughs> <laughs> nice job, Clarence. <laughs> oh, he's like little fluffy hot dogs. <laughs> Percy, you're dehydrated. Get some water. Okay. Jeff, you see if we can eat these plants. I think these are tubers. And Josh, I want you to find matches. What? I can't find matches out here. Not with that attitude, you can't. I'm gonna go hunt us an uh, elk. What the? Matches? I just don't get it. It's like he's magic or something. <laughs> Everything's going right for him. And when I try my hardest, nothing ever even pans out! That's just Clarence. Uh, where's the bathroom? Hey, you guys! I found a hot tub. <laughs> oh, he's lost it. Ah, not so easy being the leader, huh? I believe him. What? <laughs> hey guys, hop in the water's great. It smells like eggs. Why is this here? Come on in, Joshua. Don't you want to relax your tootsies in this nice natural hot tub? No, no, it's not natural. I mean, what is this? Someone hauled a hot tub out here and planted bamboo around it? <laughs> Who does that? Why not? It's awesome. I'd do it if I had a truck. I'm game. Come on, climb in here, big guy. Take a load off. Look at all those stars, guys. There's so many. And around each one, there's a bunch of planets with some aliens sitting in their alien hot tubs just looking down at us. Hey, guys. You might be right about that, actually, but alien hot tubs would be much more advanced than ours. Yeah, but they're, they're probably not having as much fun as we are. <laughs> right, Joshua? Josh, hello. Hey, buddy. You okay? Josh. Josh. Hello. Hello. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. You okay? Okay. We'll stay. Um, come again. We'll stay. This could be our spa. Huh? Oh yes. Oh, oh, uh, yes. And this, this can be my room, and this can be your rooms. Oh, I love it. And this, this can be our uh, uh, kitchen. Who wants pancakes? I don't see a kitchen. And this can be our ballroom. Oh, how we'll dance. Come on, guys. The next dance is the conga. Oh, no, I'll get you. <laughs> guys, help me. Throw down a rope or something. Don't worry, Joshua. We'll save you. Jeff, throw him a rope. Uh, we don't have a rope. Excuse me, Josh. The adults need to talk for a moment. Oh no, what do we do? 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 We could make a human chain. That's right. Human chain. 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 Do not do a human chain. I said no human chain. I changed my mind. Clarence, no more human chain. Oh! I'm gonna die! No! No! Gosh, I'm scared! Uh, uh. Don't worry, Josh. Nature Kate says that if you just believe in nature, then nature will. My parents took me on a, on a trip to Belize. Something bit my arm. 
and it swelled up so bad, so I had to go to the hospital. But it wasn't just a bite. Zephy laid eggs in my arm, and the doctor reached in with his cold tweezers and, 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 I pulled out a worm, and it wiggled. <laughs> also, I did not pass out. So you had a butt fly removed? Yeah, that's pretty gross. Until you've seen a bunch of internet videos like I have. Oh, Whoa, come, come on! Come on, come come on give it to me. Really oh, gross! I'm so unhappy. That image is in my head, and I can't get it out. <laughs> I know, Jeff. This is what the guy scraper was built for. Come on, Jeff, you must have a million stories. You think everything's gross. No, I can't. Sure you can. Come on, that noggin of yours is like a gross computer. Well, there is one story, but it's rather disturbing. Go on. I'm not sure where to start. How about at the start? It was a crisp autumn morning with notes of cinnamon in the air. Skip ahead. I was taking a shower. The water temperature, pressure, and dispersal pattern were perfect. Then... I noticed the drain. <gasps> it was backing up. I tried to evade the contaminated water, but it kept on rising and rising. There was no escape. <laughs> then what happened? And then the gross water overflowed the tub and filled up in the house and everyone was barfing all over the place. Take your time. No, the drain started working and the water went away. So basically nothing happened. Are you not listening? I'll start again. It was a crisp autumn. Save it! I got one. Time to separate the boys from the girls. <laughs> so this one night, I had a dream. I fell out of a boat, and I was stuck in the ocean. Turns out, I threw up in my sleep! <laughs> and? And you're not smart enough to get it. That's my time. Good night, Aberdale. Ooh, wait. I got another one. And this one's a real doozy. So this one time I was walking through a field of uh, broccoli and worms and and bugs, and all of a sudden I see this uh, wolf. I mean the uh, werewolf tiger with two heads made of garbage. Yeah, two garbage heads. And he goes, I'm gonna take off my fur. And he did. And his skin was just full of like mud and gunk and just jelly and peanut butter and meat fat. No good? It's time. My whole family, one RV, driving to Florida to visit my grandparents. We stopped for lunch at Fishy Phil's House of Clam Meat, 200 miles from the nearest body of water. Big mistake. And you all got sick. <gasps> so cool. uh, oh yeah, well what do you got? Fourth of July weekend, barbecue in our neighbor's yard. They had a brand new trampoline. The sweet smell of hickory smoked ribs was in the air. The tramp was empty for the first time all day. I climbed on and started jumping. One simple flip, that's all I wanted to do. But when you tried, you broke your arm. It was so bad you could see the bone. Happened to everybody in my family. That's why my dad got rid of the trampoline. Got something better? My friend was lost on the ice planet, and he cut open his weird kangaroo thing that he used to get warm. That's a movie. One time I ordered chili, and there was a rat. Saw it on the news. There was a bumblebee. Heard it. One time a shark. Heard it. A restaurant. Heard it. I heard it. <laughs> <laughs> What are you looking at? Yeah, what are you smiling about? Why don't we just ask someone? Because I know where we are. So why are we walking down this hallway for the third time? Because it's my favorite hallway. I'm asking for help. Waste of time. Excuse me. Excuse. Excuse me. Stop! Well, what is it? Hurry up. I'm in the middle of something. I, uh, was looking for my friend, Belson. Belson who? We got a lot of Belsons. Belson. Arturo Belson. Nelson Belson. Can you imagine having that name? You got a last name? Uh, N Knowles. Belson Knowles. Oh, here he is. I see you. Take the elevator to four, go right, left, down the steps, through the quad, left, left, and uh, you're there. Oh, okay. Thank you. No problem. Wait, you forgot the... Ah! Another perfect day in paradise, Bodie. I may even smile. Hey, Belson! I'm gonna try out my blowhole now. 
Morning, Belson. Hold on, the water pillow is leaking all over the place. Who let you in here again? Oh, I got my tricks. <clears throat> oh, that's nice. I think he said floor 10. <coughs> then we <coughs> get off <coughs> and take a left. <coughs> <coughs> It. Oh, elevator stuck. <laughs> Great party. Uh, yeah. Isn't this party a blast? <laughs> Everybody's here. Hey, Jeff. Hi, I'm Jeff. I'm, uh, I'm afraid of dirt. Looking sharp, Sumo. Uh, you ain't so bad yourself. So, Chelsea, is that a uh, new hair? Oh, thank you. I just grew it. Arrgh, I wish I had hair. <laughs> That's okay, Sumo. At least you're not a clumsy bag of bones like Belson here. I'm not clumsy. Your skylight was broken. Skylight? What do you mean, skylight? Belson, is there something you're not telling me? Um, isn't this supposed to be a party? Yes, it is. Party! Woohoo! 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 Party! <laughs> Sumo, get us out of here. Oh, all right. Here's a problem. Maybe not. <laughs> Come on, everybody. Let's sing one more song. Uh... Shut up! Stop it! Be quiet! Just be quiet! I didn't get hit by a car. I was pranking you. It was me, Dustin, and Nathan. I was going to change your TV channels through the skylight. I had to buy a remote on clickers.wiz because your TV is so old. And now back to hearts and hydrants, extinguishing the flames of love. But your loser skylight broke and made me slide off your loser roof! What? No! Oh! <laughs> you were so young! I don't get it. How is that a prank? Because I was going to change the channel and you were going to miss the end of your show. And that's what you consider a prank? Yeah, an awesome prank. Hmm. So if I take your spoon, is that a prank? No, that's not a prank. Can water be a prank? Uh, well, sure, I guess. Ah, ah, what are you doing? Pranking ah, And then they said that I could have my own room, but I said, no, thank you. You're not putting my grades at risk. Give it back. Give it back. <laughs> I said give it back. Sumo! Jeff, pay attention. Trust me, you'll be sorry you never learn this when you get older, okay? Okay, now where was I? Oh boy, Miss Baker needs a coffee break. Jeff, I'm here. Miss Baker, Miss Baker! Okay, not now, Jeff. Clarence, what the? What the? I told them not to do it, but does anybody ever listen to me? I'm always listening to you, Jeff. You're lucky I'm switching to contact lenses, but this mug was irreplaceable. I got it on Buford T. Pusser's third birthday, and I'll, I'll, I'll never get that memory back. I'm left with no other option. You guys are... Suspended. Suspended in disbelief when I learned what you boys did. Now, I called both of your parents already. <laughs> My phones are ringing off the hook! The president is on the phone! It's like surround sound. But neither of them picked up. So you're on the honor system to tell your families that for the next week... Give, give me your hands. Sus pended. Yeah, what does that mean? Don't be smart with me, boys. No school for a whole week. That's your punishment. But I don't understand. Wouldn't it be a better punishment if we had to do more school? Actually, that might be a good idea. No, we're really sad. Clarence, we better go and reflect about our actions and all that. See you later. Wait, wait, wait. Back up, back up, back up. Sumo, sumo. I need some, ex some explanation here. 
So we don't have to go to school for a whole week. Yeah, it's what you call a loophole. But what's the catch? No catch. This is the best thing that's ever happened. So, uh, so, uh, we can do anything we want the whole school? <laughs> 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 okay, I'm bored. Yeah. What a minute. We could do this thing I wanted the whole world. <laughs> so that's how you fix a leaky pie. So that's how you put out a burning building. So that's how all those staples get there. So that's how you apply for a high interest savings account. <laughs> so that's how you take down a crime boss. So that's how you have a healthy breakup with mutual respect. So that's how you protect your house from aliens. Let's see. Billy has three apples and he's on a train going the same rate as the circumference of two wheels plus brown? How many apples are left? Uh, okay. Well, I guess I'll just have to go with my trusty old C. At least I'm not out there losing my brain cells like the Dummy Brothers. Ah! So that's how everything is infinitely complex. From the smallest atom... ...to the largest galaxy... ...ever expanding... ...and contracting... ...simultaneously existing... ...and lifeless forever and for only a moment. <laughs> I think we learned too much. Yeah, I kind of miss school. Yeah, I also miss Jeff, too. Sorry, Goose, I'm all out. No more sandwich, see? I said I'm all out of food, Mr. Goose. That's all I got. Now, see you later. <laughs> okay. Fun is over. Sports. That's great. So <laughs> 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 oh my guys are gonna get me. Pull yourself together, kiddo. It's just a goose. There's nothing spooky about a goose. Just regular old <gasps> day. Ah! <gasps> Whew! It's just an old lady's nose. <laughs> Whew! Just squeaky swings. <gasps> Whew! That's a goose, but it's a different goose. <laughs> well, Looks like I was worried for no reason. <laughs> you blow our cover, Tum Tum. Don't you take another step. You 
win, Goose. I'm sort of running away from you. What do you want from me? What do you want from me? <laughs> oh, I get it. You were just looking for your friends. Well, goodbye, Goose. And you, you little troublemaker. We're gonna get you some food pronto. Actually, you know what's funny? It was probably just that saying, like when you're walking around and you keep bumping into the same person. And it's just by accident. And you're like, oh, why do I keep bumping into you? And they're like, I don't know. And you really just have to laugh about it. Oh my God! Oh, no, no, wrong way! This is for you. Oh, thanks, old man. <laughs> Um, is there any more that... Whoa! Uh, Clarence, can you take the trash out back, please? Yes, sir. Yep, everything was going pretty slick at my new job. Oh, yeah, except one day, this guy came in. He was a real hothead. He probably just broke out of jail and was looking for some bad blood. Can I help you? Brum, brum, brum. Haircut! Brum, 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 brum. Brum, brum, brum. So, what kind of haircut Go back! Would... Brum, 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 brum. Hold on there. I'll take these. So, what's your name, sweetie? Gunner! Um, 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 Okay, Gunner, and uh, what kind of haircut are we getting today? The back! Ah, uh, yes, the back, all right. Hmm. Now, you don't want us cutting off this nice ponytail, though, right? Uh, no. Hmm, that's what I thought. Let's see what we can do here. <laughs> Perfect. She tamed the wild beast and his hair. <gasps> My mom was the best. <laughs> That guy left the salon even more butt-kicking than ever. <laughs> Mom was a real hero at the salon. Mwah, mwah. But some beasts could not be tamed. Sandy. No. Sandy. Uh, Sandy. I think her name was Sandy. No. She started coming in all the time. Sometimes she didn't even get a haircut. She just come in to make my mom give her a shampoo. She was so old, I think she was a half robot even. Maybe that's why I come to be so mean, because she's a robot. All righty then, guess I need... Where's the blonde? I demand to see the blonde one. I only speak with the blonde. Oh, a child working in a salon? A rough. Hey, that's not... <laughs> that's my son, uh, Clarence, who was uh, just playing with Mommy's broom, but is going to leave our friend Sandy alone now and sit down like a good boy, right? But what about the duty? Why don't you just take a little break for a bit, all right? Ah. Oh, so, so sorry about that, Sandy. Uh, uh, right this way, we'll get you taken care of. <laughs> my mom and all her haircut friends at my mom's work would always be so nice to Sandy, but she was so mean to them all summer, every single time. She got meaner and meaner and meaner. So work. <laughs> Next time, it better look right. And I expect a good bargain. Good day! <laughs> well, howdy! My name's Willie, and this may sound silly, but I sell chili. Who wants a sample? Ooh, I do. Here you go, sport. And now, time for a dilly. Oh, first you have the beans, and then you have the greens, and mix them. Ah, oh, oh. That's it. I don't know how you put up with this. I just... The Kevin, wait. Coupon. Good for one free shampoo. <sighs> okay, Sandy, right this way. Uh, uh, uh. 